For question number 28, we go to scientist 2's explanation. Out here, we look at a statement given in the second passage. The bones of non-avian dinosaurs were dense and had growth rings. Each of these features indicates a low RMR and is neither seen in the bones of modern birds. Hence, would scientists too more likely expect to find bones that have growth rings in a crocodile or in a modern bird? It would be a crocodile since out here, uh, growth rings in bones indicate low RMR and is neither seen in the bones of modern birds. Options C and D are eliminated. Option A states crocodile. Scientists too suggested that growth rings indicate a high RMR, which is not true since it is indicating a low RMR. Option B states crocodile. Scientists too suggested that growth rings indicate a low RMR, which is true, hence making option B the correct choice.